Hey guys, what's up? It's Sarah Jane. Thank you for coming back to my YouTube channel. <clears throat> so, I've been going through some stuff on my memory cards and my hard drive and kind of just seeing what I had that I never posted for you guys. Um, <clears throat> so this one's going to be from winter. I apologize. Um, with how hot it's been lately, maybe this might uh, cool you down some. Uh, basically, we were like freezing. Um, the heat went out on like some of the coldest days of the year. Uh, this past, I think it was like January or February, somewhere in there. It was, it was bad. Luckily, my my future mother-in-law's boyfriend was able to look at it and fix or replace the heater. I can't remember what she ended up doing. But yeah, it, it got pretty cold. Um, I was more worried about the cats than myself, which I'll discuss in the video. But yeah, we're okay now. Um, it took a little while for everything to get warm again, go back to the way it was. But by the time I came home that day that it was finally fixed, it was like a sigh of relief. So I'm just gonna show you guys and I hope you enjoy. So, I wanted to vlog the past few days, but it's been really cold at our house. Our heat went out. We live in the Midwest. It's been snowing a lot. The warmest it's been in the last three, four days has been nine. <laughs> at least as far as I, I saw when we were home got very cold. I mean, as you can see, we have a big window and that isn't very good insulation. Um, Tony and I finally grabbed a big blanket and stuffed it in the window in our bedroom to make sure it stayed. Um, we bought a heated blanket the second time it went out. So the first time it went out, it was like two, three in the morning. Tony started freaking out. I realized how cold it was. We basically huddled together for warmth and he cuddled with me for longer than he has ever cuddled with me in the eight years we've been together. We um, we woke up and it was still off and there was like nothing we could do. Um, he, it was his day off. I had to go to work. I went to work grateful because <laughs> it was so cold in here and I felt, I was so worried about him and the boys I mean, our cats aren't that big. They, they're they low to the ground. We live downstairs. His mom lives upstairs. And I knew it was going to get cold. So I, I called him a couple times because it, it got really busy that day. Um, but I called him a couple times to see if he was okay. Um, that was a Wednesday. Wednesday night, I came home expecting it to be cold. It was still cold. Thursday when I got up it was so cold like I couldn't feel my legs and I just got another tattoo <laughs> so the big paw is my um, childhood dog and I don't know if you can see but I got her name on here my sister's got the same tattoo so it's Daisy Bird and then last week, that was through about two weeks ago, two, three weeks ago. And then last week I got the little one, which is from Eve. Um, those of you who have been on this channel forever know that she was my first baby. She was my first, um, my first cat. She was my emotional support animal. I got those. So I've been, I have to wash new tattoos for the first week, three times a day. And our water is warm, but it takes a long time for it to get warm. So it's like ice water to clean it. And then you have to dry it. And even then it's still freezing. So it was a rough couple days. Um, Thursday, we got a message from his mom saying the, the heat was back on. We got home. It was normal in the house, thank goodness. And then when we, um, we started watching TV and eating dinner, the heater started making noises again. 
So he told his mom. And the next morning she had to turn it off and it was cold again. Um, basically, the something was wrong with the motor. They needed to order more parts. And if, um, if they had kept it on, it could have burned out and she would have had to replace the entire unit, which would have been way more money. So we were without heat for another two days. Um, so that was Thursday. Thursday night is when it, we had to turn it off. Um, so we had no heat for all of Friday and mm, probably half of Saturday. No, more than that. Um, so Saturday we, we got up, I had, um, I had a appointment somewhere and I went there for a couple hours and then went grocery shopping because I didn't want to go back to a cold house and we had to get groceries anyway. Came home, I worked out, I finally forced myself to work out with the cold the way it was. Um, the one day it was warm I had worked out too, but it could be, yeah, it will warm you up when you're cold, but the warmer you are, the faster you cool down. Um, so after I had done a Zumba on Saturday, I almost immediately started feeling freezing. So I went right into the bath, right into the bathroom, took my shower, and I was still cold. Um, and then we went to a friend's house to do D and D. Um, by the time we got home, it was back up. So they told me, um, hopefully at the earliest Sunday, but Saturday night it was back on, thank goodness. Um, we still used the heated blanket, we still did everything because I wanted to make sure. And I'm still cold. It's going to take a while for me to uh, think mentally that this is fixed. But yeah, it was a scary moment. I was so worried for the boys. They're still... Um, crunched down like that and then Yang has been on his heated bed for like the last three days so I know that they were having issues and I was worried for um, her birds too Tony's mom has two two birds two tropical birds and um, it was really cold so she did get us a little ceramic heater so we were using that for a good majority of the time um, and that was constantly blasting, as well as the heated blanket we turned on for the boys when we left. And she has a heater upstairs for the birds, so I think that helped um, quite a bit. I was wearing my, my slippers that Tony gave me for Christmas. Or I guess it was my grandfather that gave them to me because I used the gift card he got me to buy slippers. <laughs> um, so, and I wore the robes that Tony got me for Christmas. So, it was a rough couple of days. I'm just glad that we now have heat. He's so loud when he cleans himself. So that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you next time. Bye!